Hey guys, EVP Man here, and if you're a secure folder user, you need to watch this video. Check out these tips on how to restore all your icons if they ever disappear. Let's check it out. So if you've been using the secure folder, um, like I do for business or for personal use just to, to privatize some of your information, you know how useful it is. But what if all the icons that would show up in the secure folder are gone and there's no way to access your emails, your text messages, uh, your photos or videos, anything that you've stored in that area? It would probably freak you out. And it freaked me out because that actually happened to me yesterday. And as I was trying to find on the internet ways to get it back, I saw a lot of advice, a lot of things that were going on. But the thing that kept on worrying me the most is what if I follow those steps, which were not many, and I were to screw up and lose all my files, everything that was, that was there, all my settings. So this video, I'm going to show you how you can restore all the icons uh, that may disappear in your secure folder without losing any data. Now, before we do that, let me just explain the secure folder for those of you who are seeing this video or this function for the first time. The secure folder, and I have it here on my side panel, allows you to separate emails, text messages. It's literally like having a separate secure phone. It's an encrypted area that no one has access to unless um, you go in. So you can have an additional level of security. So when you log into your phone, either with your retina or your fingerprint or your code, that's one level of security. But to get into your secure folder, it requires a second level of security. And it could be a different password uh, or it could be the same password that you use to access your phone. Now, by doing that, it separates things. So that means that any pictures, any videos, any emails, any text, there's a lot of applications in there. Any, you could have like a separate Facebook, you could have a Tumblr account, whatever it is, uh, also WhatsApp that's in there, and that is going to be privatized and secure. So let's go into it, and I'll show you what you'll have to do. Now, for the sake of the illustration, I've added some additional apps here that are not traditionally part of the secure folder. So the secure folder typically has your gallery, calendar, contacts, email, camera, internet, all these things that you see here. So I added um, some other ones here at the very bottom just to show you that you can add more programs. Now, let's imagine that all these are gone and that happens and it's happening more frequently than it should. How do you get them back? Well, the first thing you don't want to do is you don't want to disable or delete the secure folder. Don't do that because you'll lose all your information. Because the first thing that you need to recognize is that by losing all these icons, you have not lost anything. So what you're going to do is you're going to go up here into settings. You're going to come down to applications. And once you go into applications, you're going to look for, and mine are sorted alphabetically, you're going to look for something that's called secure folder. Now, Samsung regularly is updating the secure folder, uh, the software, right, for it. And at times, a software update, or just like any other software, uh, something can, can be corrupt. So what you're going to do is you're going to uninstall it. Yeah, and I know that sounds scary. So we're looking for the secure folder. Uh, it sounds scary because, uh, again, you don't want to lose any of your information. You see how it says secure folder? So you're going to go into the secure folder setting. And then what you're going to do here is you're going to do an uninstall, right? So what I'll do is I'll go downstairs right to this area which says app details in store. So I'm going to tap on it. And then what you'll see is a uninstall function. So what this is going to do is it's not going to delete the folder. Make sure you understand that. It does not delete the folder. I tested this and I did not lose any of my information. I did not lose any of my contacts. I didn't lose any of my settings. I didn't lose any of my apps, chats, texts, whatever. What you're going to do is uninstall. And this is going to remove all the updates. It's going to remove all the updates that the application has. And then what it's going to do is, uh, what you're going to do is once you've done that, you're going to uh, reinstall them. Now, reinstall it. So once you do the uninstall, you're going to be able to reinstall it. You'll see it on the screen. And then what I recommend you do is you shut down your phone. Recommend that you start up your phone again and then go into your secure folder. All of your apps, the, the shortcuts will be there nothing will be lost. So again, the key is you're going to uninstall, shut down, um, well, uninstall, reinstall it, shut down, start up, and then you go into your secure folder and all of your icons will be fully restored and you will not have lost any app settings or any content. And again, I did this. I've tested it a couple times. Unfortunately, I'm not able to recreate it again to show you here, but this is how you fix this. 
So I hope this helps those of you who are right now in panic mode uh, because your secure folder has lost all these icons and you don't know what to do. Follow those steps. You should not have any problems. Like I said, I've done this now uh, to my phone and to friends who's had the same problem. No issues whatsoever. And that's what drove me to write this video. So uh, once again, hit that subscribe button so you get updated uh, with more tips and tricks like this. And as always, thanks for watching.